Where could she be? I must be close by now. You found me, Keeper. Why all the secrecy? A precaution. Mortal eyes can't see what I have to show you. Well, before you do, I don't know what happened. I went to take an artifact like I've done before, and... Can you fix it? Unfortunately, I cannot. There must be a way. My, my grandfather's spear... Is most likely useless. The spear of Leonidas was overwhelmed by the Isu energies it held. Some force in the artifact must have pushed it to its limits. So it's gone. After all, it's done for me. I'm afraid so. But your powers are not limited to the spear. Your oath as keeper of the staff makes your destiny much more complex. Let me show you. What am I looking at exactly? The world, the planet Earth where you live, and on it are all its people, good and bad, innocent and knowing, peaceful and violent. These are the places where you will find the world's Isu artifacts. They lie hidden, for now. There's more of them? Who put them there? They aren't there without reason, but we aren't always wise to the why and who. They serve a mysterious purpose. What are you saying? There is a task that lies ahead for the Keeper of the Staff, if you are willing to take it. A task that will take the rest of your mortal life. Undisturbed, the artifacts are no threat, but if found by the wrong kind, human life may be destroyed. So, my spear has no power, and I have to leave the world I know to find more of these things that took it away. Things that turn people into monsters. Yes, to stop more monsters from existing. You're asking for way too much. Do you know how tired I am? Every day exhausts me. Show me no more. I only show you to prepare you for a potential destiny. You know what can happen if the artifacts find their way to mortal hands. Look, I came to you to have my spear fixed. If you can't do that, then I'm leaving. You know their power, Keeper. Their potential. Humanity does not. I didn't ask for this. Maybe I don't want to live forever. Don't I get a say in my own fate? Forget you, and forget the artifacts. I'm leaving. Consider what I've said. So, my spear is broken, and I'm being asked to find countless artifacts around the world. Forever. Happy vacation, Alexios. This is... too much. How could I ever explain this to Erotodos and Barnabas? They'd never understand. What to say when I find them? Watch my step around here.
Ela. Alexios, we have a problem. Where is Varnabas? He took off alone to find the object that broke your spear. What? Has he gone mad? I tried to explain to him it would be fruitless, but he wouldn't listen. He thought finding it was the answer. You should have stopped him. Do you understand what that thing can do? He wanted to help. So he does that instead of staying out of trouble. I have to find it before Van Vas does. Malaka. When I find you, Van Vas, what were you thinking going after it? I should try to stay out of sight. We're still investigating this area. Touch something and we won't be so nice. Stop! Ah! Ah! Don't Most worry. You. This won't take long. Come <laughs> on. 
The artifact definitely landed here, but no sign of Varnavas. Let's take a look around. Bodies are badly burned. What happened? These footprints. Were pirates chasing Varnabas? They go in this direction. This leads to that farm down there. Something's going on over there. I should take a look. Will not be forgotten, friend. Who here can tell me what happened? A man was here. He tore up our farm. Not one man. Ten. Twenty. One at a time. What did he look like? He was a one eyed madman. Nothing he touched was safe. He burned my crops! No! He was over there, destroying my stall! He was everywhere! All right. Alexios, I believe it's true. Varnabas found the artifact. If the letter was right, this object has the power to corrupt its holder beyond recognition. It's true. I've looked into the eyes of the monsters they make. The people inside won't come back. They can't come back. 
And the artifact? How could we possibly take it away from the very beast it's created? I don't know. There has to be some way. But if he's too far gone... I can't think that far ahead. Not yet. What can we do? I have to find Varnavas. Before it's too late. But the pirates are after him. Soldiers would kill him for the damage he's caused. I have to try. I won't let it take him. Follow his chaos. It seems like he headed towards Cassiope. Hurry! should stop them if they're after one of us. This will be so much easier with my spear. Great and powerful Zeus, I am not well. Call your son Apollo. Cure me of this madness. I, I will do anything. Barnabas. Alexios. Oh, Alexios, you have to help me. Something's very wrong. I know, Barnabas. I know. You have to give me the artifact. I'm scared. I know you are. Just hand it over, all right? But... It's causing you to act this way. If you give me the artifact, everything will be okay. But it protects me! It's the only thing that keeps me safe! I know you're still in there. Can't you see what it's doing to you? With this, I don't have to be afraid anymore! I've been a weakling and a coward, and now I'm as powerful as a god! The real you would never say that. Give it to me. It is mine! Stop! I don't want to hurt you. Yeah! <laughs> 
I know your weakness lies not in your brawn, but your heart. No, please! Do not kill me. I surrender. Please. It's not the real you. I have to weaken it. I have to keep going. You once saved me. Remember, Alexios? That's where our journey began. Don't they? Stop me. it! They're not real. They're not real. Oh, gods, let me not be killed. Let Alexios spare me. Forgive me, Varnavas. I'm... I'm so weak. Please, don't hurt me. I won't hurt you. Just give me the artifact. Help me, please. Who am I? What's become of me? You're one of us. My friend. If you keep it, I'll be someone else forever. You are no friend! You are going to leave me as soon as you have it! I will not let fear take me! Don't make me do this! That is precisely what I will make you do! Unless you are the one who is afraid! going to leave a mark. Oh, no question. <laughs> Did it hurt you? Uh, it got me all right, but I won't lose it. <laughs> Thank the gods. Whoever heard of a man with one arm and one eye? <laughs> uh, uh, though I am slightly embarrassed, I really thought I was on to something there. <laughs> what were you thinking going after the artifact? How could you be so stupid? Who cares about your arm when you could have died? At least my intentions were good. You have no idea what almost happened. I almost killed you. Oh, don't worry. I'm as sturdy as a military ship. Listen to me. I'm immortal. Get it? You are not. You make mistakes, and you die! Gone! And you leave everyone else to deal with it! Immortal? Truly immortal? Yes. Immortal. Surprise. <laughs> I, I knew you had the God's touch! Everyone I love, I have to leave behind. And I almost had to leave you. Forever. Alexios, it is the mortal way. We all go when the gods say so. And I eagerly await an afterlife of calm seas and bottomless crab cakes. It's not funny. Maybe not. But did we ever have fun today? That's what matters, eh? We don't know how long we have the present, but it's a gift as good as gold. Gold. You did take me on a treasure hunt, after all. And all I got was a busted arm. <laughs> 
Let's get you patched up. Keeper, see for yourself. You are a protector of men, an intermediary of our world and theirs. Your journey will take you to lands of kings, queens, and conquerors, over water and through fire, into revolution and rebellion. But your presence will mean peace, Keeper. Take up this task, for them and for yourself. That's one treasure hunt over, but there's still another one out there. Maybe I should look for Hirotodos and Barnvas' tombs. You can't say I wasn't successful in getting Alexios out of his funk. Out of my funk, but into a lot more trouble. Oops. <laughs> Did I already apologize for that? <laughs> Coming to Corfu, I had no inkling that we would get caught up in a tale of legendary treasure. They say life gets dull without surprises. Now that's a reason to cheers. And to you, Icarus. Yes. We all have but one life to lead. We have to do the most with it. One life? Speak for yourself. You're right, Barnabas. Heroes like Alexios will live on in the stories and legends of their triumphs. They live forever. Listen. I want you two to know. I'll be leaving soon. ...to travel across waters I've never dreamed of crossing. And... ...I don't know when I'll be back. You're leaving... ...again? Where? Why? I'll go wherever I'm needed in the world. I can't run from my responsibilities. Someone... ...I mean... Something tells me my journey is not over yet. We couldn't possibly keep you for ourselves. Though you'll be everywhere in my writings, that's for certain. I'm honored. Maybe you could give me one of your manuscripts, Sirotodos. I'm sure even those from far off lands would love to read it. <laughs> Don't trouble yourself. These lands will do for now. But, if you're serious, a storyteller is always prepared. Take it, but feel no need to share it. It's for you. 
I have something for you, too. No. The spear. You knew what it was the moment you met me. But I've outgrown it. It's yours now. Careful. It's still sharp. I'll cherish it forever. Well, though I'm not one to refuse a gift, the, the gift of friendship is enough for me. You only want friendship? Huh. I guess I'll need to find another second in command for my trip. Me? Traveling the world? With you? If you'll have me as your captain. I don't know how much longer these old bones can hoist a sail. But I'll go as far as I can. The Adrestia is yours. What will be your first stop, Alexios? <sighs> I don't know. What I do know is that I need a new weapon. Egypt has always fascinated me. Ah, one of my favorite places. Let me tell you one of my best stories. Everyone will read your words, Herodotus. 